to Joe's Cop Playbook. Today I'm going to show you guys how to win in Free For All in Bayview because of some certain misfunctional things in the map. Now Bayview is pretty much of a great map. It's just that there's some big mistakes with the spawn system. Now, this is not going to be the beginning of the match. This is actually going to be like in the middle of the match. It's probably going to take like a minute or so to actually, uh, to actually like turn into that. As you can see, the little X's represent the spawns. Now, in the middle of the match, these X's right here are going to be the permanent spawns. Now, these are going to be like, most of the time, are going to be like this. Only The only way this spawn can actually be cancelled is if somebody stays up here. So, make sure there's nobody up here most of the time. Now, this is how you're going to make it work. Now, this glitch, well, it's not like a glitch, it's more like a spawn problem. Um, what you need to do is stay in this area that's all you need to do just stay in this area now the other area of the map you never bother with it you never go to the other side because that's the area where you're really gonna get less kills from you're not gonna go in this area do not go to the green part avoid this part of the area as much as possible because you're not gonna find anybody you're not gonna find anybody rushing through there everybody's gonna be on this part of the map now the way you're going to make this work in order for you to make the spawns go like this because there's one, two, three, four, five. Now this one in the bar is going to be in the second floor. So if you're down here, people are, are really going to spawn up there like automatically. If there's somebody camping up there, of course nobody's going to spawn up there, but yet people are going to spawn out here. So you got to be very careful what you do. So this is what you're going to do. In order for you during the middle of the match to th for this to happen, you gotta be running through this part. So let me change the color so you guys can see the difference. And uh, this is what you're gonna do. So you're gonna stay in the first floor and you're gonna be running in circles. In running in circles. You can do it the other way around also, but uh, you know, I usually do it like this. So I run like that from uh, from the outside. So this one, you're going to stay in here, like around this area on the first floor. You're going to be going through the house, through the outside, and you're going to be looking through all the spawns. One, two, three, four. When you facing out, when you're about to go outside from the bar, like from this area, you're going to make sure you look in two ways. Now let me change the color to yellow. All right. You always got to keep and look to this side. If you don't see no one up here, then you turn into this one. That's going to be your radius of the view. Right there. This part right here. You can use your peripherals. Do not say no. That's a quick view right there. You're going to give a quick look. Nobody's there. All right, I can make sure you automatically look to this part right here. Like 100%. Make sure there's no one right there. Because sometimes they actually do camouflage. So, um, you know. Make sure there's someone right there. If there's someone right there, take him down. Run to your right. Do not go out here. No, look. This is what I don't want you guys to do because I know most of you guys are going to be doing this. Where's the green? There you go. Do not even bother with this whole area right here. Do not go to the tracks. I'm telling you right now. Do not go to the tracks. All that little green area right here, do not go to it. Do not step on the tracks. Stay on the path stay on this path and you're gonna be able to see people coming out through here rushing out they're mostly gonna be facing this way so uh, when you're going through here you can act automatically blindside him so that's one down and then this guy's gonna try to run through here inside the house you blindside him and also you can also look over here on this part right here oh, let me change the color so all you need to do is sometimes look over here not most of the time just keep an eye out there but, you know, just go up here, like right here in this corner, and then look over here in the aquarium. Now, as you can see, this might be people rushing down there because they know where you're at. But if there's no one coming in, I want you to go back inside the bar and repeat the process. And you should be able to see this guy right here spawn glitching. Now, this is where the glitch happens. This right here, this little X right here is going to be the glitch. Because this one is going to keep spawning automatically, 100%. This one's automatic. So this is going to be the free kill. This little part right here. 
that's your free kill. The other two are going to be scrambled. Sometimes he's going to spawn right here, so you got to be quick before he reaches behind you. So these two are scrambling. These three are scrambling right here. All I need to just keep an eye on them. Just keep an eye. I always get running around in circles. Just keep running around in circles. Sometimes you may want to, you know, be creative sometimes and go all the way out, but do not go on the roads, on the railroads. Yes, you can see these two spawns right here. Sometimes this guy right here is going to be an easy kill, but sometimes, you know, he's going to be very prepared for you. So watch out because this guy is going to automatically spawn here even if you're five yards away. So be careful. So the way you can build up your kill streaks real easily is by staying in this area right here on the red side. That's all you need to do to stay on the west side of the boardwalk. To stay in the bar, do not camp. I'm not asking you to camp. I'm asking you to just rush around the bar. Just keep checking the bar. And you should be able to do just fine. And this one is always going to be a free kill. Right here. So that's the playbook, guys. Hopefully you guys like the Bayview playbook. Because I know most of you guys are going to be heading over to Free For All. And try to see if you can do better solo. Well, there's your, there's your chance to win in Bayview most of the time. Like 90% of the time, you're going to win like this. If you go around in circles in the bar. So leave a like guys, leave a comment to me what's up. If you like the playbook, please let me know. Uh, I'll be trying to, you know, scout the other maps so I can teach you guys how to win in Free For All. Because I know most of you guys want to head over to different stuff in Call of Duty Ghost. So uh, this is all for now. Leave a like, leave a comment, tell me what's up. And subscribe for more guys, more playbook coming up.